Here's everything you're going to need to apply. You're going to need your cha-cha covers, a small pair of scissors, a little container with water, your gamma nail polish or any nail polish color you want, a base coat and a top coat, a small nail file, and your nails. So what you're going to do, you're going to apply a base coat, the color nail polish that you want. We prep the nail. We're going to go ahead and take out the decals from the packaging. And you're going to notice that they're not stickers, so you're going to actually have to cut them out. And you're going to go ahead and measure your nail with the decal size. You're going to cut out the color decals exactly according to the shape and the design. Cut around that white part. If you leave the white part on there, it's going to actually show up on your nail. Dip the decal into the container of water. And while that's soaking, you're going to apply a coat of base coat. As soon as you take the decal, you're going to notice it's going to start to slide off of the paper, which is a good thing. If it doesn't, you can put it back in. But if it does come off, you're going to go ahead and place it onto the nail and form it and shape it. What's kind of cool about this is because the nail polish is still wet, you can move it however you want and the decal does stretch. And that's on there. The black and white ones are pretty cool because you don't have to cut around the actual nail shape. You can just cut around the design, dip it in water again. And while that dips, put a layer of base coat onto your nail that will allow the decal to slide around once you put it on. Just like the other one, you're going to take it out and it's going to slide right off. And you're going to go ahead and put it onto the nail. Put it wherever you want on the nail. And make sure it doesn't have any bumps or lumps on there. And sometimes your nails are not going to be long enough for the design. So this is where the nail file comes in. You are going to file the bottom very, very, very gently because the decal can stretch a bit. And once you cut it all off and you're happy with the design, apply your final top coat to make it nice, shiny, and glossy. You can enhance the decals by adding an extra border around it. You can add rhinestones or studs. You don't have to necessarily apply nail polish for the color one. You can put it on your plain natural nail, the same for the black and white. And I hope this was nice and easy for you.